Good evening, my dear J aspirants. And if you are serious about J, there is no way you should even miss this NSCP examination because not only can you get a chance to get into IIT directly, but also there are a lot of advantages and a lot of things which many people are unaware of. So let me get straight to the point of what this exam is all about and welcome about everyone who is joining in live ordinary everyone join in. Hi, Swain. Good, good evening. Now. First of all, let me tell you, there is an official website of NSAP and what is this NSAP also, I will tell you. So, first of all, it stands for National Standard Examination in Physics. It's like your entry to the Olympiads world. Now, what is Olympiads? Sir, I don't know what is Olympiads. So, let me tell you, Olympiads is like Olympics, which is there for sports, but think of Olympics for academics. So, Olympiads is just like Olympics for sports. So, is the examination tough? Of course. Is it higher than JE Advanced? Of course. Do many students crack it? No. Very few students crack. But sir, if very few students crack, then why do kids even give it? Well, I can ask the same thing for JE. But the point about Olympiads, even though it is so tough and you know, it's not like you get many admissions through Olympiads. Well, there are some colleges which do take admissions. I'll talk about it also. The point is, your mental ability, your problem solving skills, your whole way of looking at the world, your interest in the subject, deep diving and sometimes even the passion for that subject is what drives people to take this examination. And also, since you can see how many students give this examination, by the way, it's around 2 lakh students, guys. So if you are thinking, oh, it must be a few hundred or few thousands. No, in India, 2 lakh students write just the NSCP examination. This is for physics. Like that you have astronomy and chemistry and biology and other things also. Okay. So, it's very important to understand that these 2 lakh students are actually the serious aspirants. And if you think carefully, you know, around 1 lakh 60, 1 lakh 70, 2 lakh students they are the general students who get into or basically write the J advanced examination. So, if around 1 lakh 60, 1 lakh 80 thousand students are writing the J advanced and 2 lakh students are writing the Olympiad physics exam, it gives you an idea that only the serious aspirants are giving and that is your actual competition with which you can understand what the reality is. Because otherwise, you might give hundreds of tests, you might be giving all India level test series, but this is a proper, you know, benchmark to tell you where you stand, especially in physics. All right. So now that you understand, okay, the seriousness is there. Two lakh students are there. You get reputation. You get qualification. You are then renowned. You know that, okay, you are an Olympiad scholar. But what exactly, how does this process work? Let me explain this to you. First of all, this is mainly for class 10th, 11th and 12th students. By the way, all the three students will be writing the same exam. Okay. So, be careful about it. Okay. Some of you will be thinking, sir, I am 11th standard. How can I attempt 12th standard portion? But that is the whole point. Many kids start preparing from 10th only. Okay. And some students are already appearing for junior science Olympiads. So, they usually write it in class 10th and class 11th itself. But usually, most of the domination is from the 12th standard audience. Okay, the syllabus is your school level physics with more emphasis on the concepts and the application. When I say school level, it means class 11th and class 12th, not class 10th. Okay, so it's almost NCRT syllabus, but it's not like, sir, if I study NCRT, will I crack this? No, definitely not. Okay, it is conducted by IAPT, like JE exam is conducted by NTA. Same way, the body which conducts this examination is called IAPT, Indian Association of Physics Teachers. When you clear NSCP, by the way, even I wrote my exam and I had cleared it during my time. Okay. So, next stage is basically you write INPHO. Yeah, Indian National Physics Olympiad. Now, when you write NSCP and you qualify for INPHO, please remember in the entire country, barely couple of hundreds of students only are there. It's not even going to cross thousands. Okay. So, bear that in mind. Very few students clear NSCP and go to INPHO. Once you go to INPHO, which is the physics Olympiad, the proper physics Olympiad, then few students only will make it to the camp, 
which is the India camp. Okay. In that India camp, you will be again trained for the International Olympiad. So, going to the camp is a very big thing. Qualifying is itself a big thing. Going to the camp is a very, very big achievement because those top three, four hundred students are going to battle it out and they are going to get selected in the camp. And from that camp, representing India is a very, very big achievement. And you will be representing India at an international level. So there will be students from US, Canada, Brazil, this, that. All students will take part in the International Olympiad. Understood the levels? And in that, some students get gold and silver and bronze. Are you understanding the seriousness, the level of the examination now? Okay. So why, why NSAP? Okay, sir. So I, I don't think I can crack INPHO. I, I'm not going to go to the camp. Fine. No issues. Why should I even write this? Because this is too much. I don't think I can participate at international level. I'll tell you why. First of all, you are going to go deep into the physics concepts. Right? Okay? Yeah. You have to have core level knowledge. Correct, Nathan? And I should see you're a number three fan. Right? Uh, which colleges you can get? Sarah, I'm going to tell you that. Yeah, and it's only physics. Yes, only physics. How to register also, I'm going to show you. Don't worry. It is a national level examination. You are getting the true sense of competition. It is also going to add value. See, if you just even clear this, clear NSAP and go to INPHO, you can add it in your profile. And there are a lot of private colleges which appreciate it, like Scalar School, Newton School, this school. All of them, if you are an Olympiad, Qualified student also, you're not even represented India. Forget that. That's it. You have just cleared that stage. They automatically grant scholarships. They reserve seats for you. So that is the respect that you get. Not just in society, but at college level. And if you are planning to study abroad, let's you apply for NSU in Singapore or let's you apply for MIT or Stanford in US. If you say that you have cleared NSAP, you have qualified for INPHO, automatically your profile is placed at a higher category. Okay, it is considered of higher value. If you are already representing India, forget it. I mean, like you are at a top notch level, easy entry to top notch Ivy League. Ivy League means in, in, in not just India, whole world we are talking about. Okay, the top colleges in Europe, the top colleges in US, we are talking about that type of colleges, the top colleges in the world. You can easily, uh, you know, get admissions. It adds your to, weight to your profile. Also, when you crack the physics Olympiad, doing the J advanced questions, BITSAT questions, or, you know, IAT questions, either aptitude test questions, or NEST examination questions becomes easier. Now you have gone into that critical thinking mode, you have deep dived into your knowledge at the fundamental concepts level, you can definitely do the J advanced questions much easily. Okay. Now, what are the colleges which take admissions via INPHO? First is IIT Madras. 14 courses are there. IIT Kanpur, 6 courses. IIT Gandhinagar. So, just imagine just writing the physics part and getting into IIT. Isn't it cool, guys? How many of you loved it? Quickly smash that like button right away right now. Okay. How to register? Registration has not yet started. It will start in August, just few months from, uh, sorry, few weeks from now. As you can see, uh, you can um, uh, visit this particular website and NSEP examination. You can just Google it. Uh, registration has not yet started, but on this website, you can also get the papers of the previous years, like NSEP paper, answer key, all these things are there. Now, if you want us to conduct some sessions on it, please let me know. We can do some top NSAP questions, uh, you know, in the coming weeks. So, all the questions are mentioned over here. Okay, beautiful questions, beautiful, uh, uh, you know, concepts being tackled over here. All the important links are there. Registration has not yet started. Okay, just keep that in mind. It will start as soon as it starts. I will let you know. So, for that, stay subscribed so that I can update you on time. You can see if you are a gold medalist in NCP, you can directly join DAE. Yeah, your Atomic Energy Institute, right? Directly through the interview without appearing for the entrance test. That's the best part. And there are up to 10 scholarships which will be given if you pursue pure science in physics. If you are already into the Olympiad League, scholarships are also awarded to the students. 
सर दिस इज रियली कूल सिलेबस इज ऑल्सो एनसीआर टी बट आई डीप डाइव आई कैन डू दैट एंड आई लव फिजिक्स सर एंड आई वॉन्ट टू चेक माई कॉन्सेप्ट एट अ नेशनल लेवल एंड ऑलरेडी टू लैख स्टूडेंट आर गिविंग सो वॉट इज द स्टोरी कैन यू टेल मी वॉट विधान टू इज डूइंग वेल लेट मी टेल यू डिड आई नॉट टेल यू अबाउट इंटरनेशनल लेवल एंड गेटिंग गोल्ड वेल अवर स्टार स्टूडेंट ग्रूव गॉट गोल्ड इन आई पी एच ओ दिस इज इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री Yes, he's a gold medalist from Vidantu, and he learned with us, learned with us, you know, online. This is insane, guys. And Dhruv just didn't crack the physics Olympiad at an international level with gold, but he was also shortlisted for the camp. He was also shortlisted, for, uh, you know. Uh, in KVPY, he had got one zero five rank. A long time back, there used to be a, a KVPY examination, yeah, scholarship exam. Now it is no longer there. He got all India rank one zero five. He also, uh, you know, conquered the astronomy Olympiads. Okay, he got rank six in twenty twenty two in OPHO as well. And the story just doesn't end there. I mean, if you talk about astronomy Olympiads, just last year, Panini, Panini. Daksh and Sanidhya, all of them, three out of five students who represented India in astronomy Olympiad at international level, three out of five were from Vedanta. This is insane. And not just that. I mean, it goes on. The story continues. If you talk about 2024, last year, we had eight students who went to the camp, who went, who wrote, uh, who went uh, qualified from the NSCP. into the next stage remember few hundred students only qualify nscp and enter into the olympiad league and out of that eight students were from vedantu all eight from vedantu online this is really cool also we had our student riddesh who won silver at asian physics olympiad there is a separate olympiad lot of olympiads are there the most famous Uh, ones being NSCP and the uh, further stages, but this is a separate Olympiad called as the Asian Olympiad. There also, Riddesh, our Vedantu student, you know, um, got silver over there, and he is going to ride the Olympiad this year. He is a 2026 aspirant, by the way, just like you. So, for all of you, you know, we have a separate dedicated lecture series with test papers. discussions and study material which will be provided and i'll tell you the best part do you see the name dhruv do you see the name dhruv now where was dhruv he is our student so we named a batch only after dhruv because dhruv got gold medal in our physics olympiad ipho so same name we have taken and we have created a batch because whatever material whatever coaching same teachers who taught dhruv will be teaching you okay the 2025 batch and we will not only be training you for nscp if you qualify nscp and you enter into inpho league we will be training you for that it's a pure english batch for class 10th to 12th standard students there will be test series concept based lectures all lectures are live recordings notes everything will be given all the sessions will be in the night reason many of you will be joining join some coaching maybe you are going to offline or online so after that this will be extra coaching don't worry not all the days only two sessions will be there per week one test discussion one concept teaching also is there and these concepts i can guarantee you nobody will be teaching you anywhere in the country even online or offline so these are extra concepts apart from what you are learning nobody will be teaching you 100% and there are 17 tests part and full syllabus each test 1.5 hours they are already planned and same content which dhruv used to clear the nscp and enter into inpho same content same teachers everything guys all the material is going to be given to you live okay now the batch sir how do i register the link is there in the description box what is the price it's 15000 the batch has just started this week it will start this week basically 15000 rupees sir please give us some discount fair enough so we have given the discount you know it's just now 11666 rupees so you are getting around 3500 rupees off but sir that is also not okay i'm watching your video do something special for me so we spoke to the finance team 
and made sure that only for some few hours till certain restriction is there only for some few days the price is going to go further down to 6999 only for a limited time as soon as that limited time is over the price will come back to 11666 so it's only possible because we have spoken to the financing use the link or use the coupon code shreyas nsep that will help you get that discount 6999 that's a very good price the link is there in the description box of this particular video as you're watching quickly smash the like button out there nsap batch link and you will see all the things it's a pure english batch you have your specialized teachers you have uh, you know ap sir's guidance along with vikas sir vikas sir i'm pretty sure you have heard of and then after that chandan saini sir who are all olympiad j advanced teachers they are only going to teach you okay it's going to start on july 27 like i said this week 6999 instead of 15000 complete 16 weeks access is available till next year so you can use it even for j mains that's the best part test series tips and tricks live classes notes everything is a part of it you can just say buy full course choose multiple options whichever is feasible for you and be a part of the batch all right so that's your dhruv batch so maybe next year if you qualify and clear and get a gold medal maybe there is a batch after you by the way another surprise all our olympia toppers who won gold medal silver medals we are naming the batches after their names so we are having a vedant batch okay we are going to have dhruv batch so students are going to decide our batch names so maybe next year it is going to be your name all right who knows so see you guys and get mentored by the best teachers in the country at the comfort of your home the batches are late in the night so it will not affect your regular je or a need or whatever you know even board preparation at all so it will never clash with any other uh, you know classes as well cool thank you so much please register as soon as the entry point opens in august but the batch is going to start right now this week because students have started preparation okay bye bye take care have a great time